Welcome back, everybody, to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan. Welcome back to exploring the world of Azeroth in World of Warcraft. Today's adventure leads us to the Well of Eternity, uh, the time-walking dungeon that is very exciting and a lot of fun. Uh, as you can see, I am already out of bounds in the map, and I actually use Hidden Azeroth's method, so all the props to him. Thank you, Hidden Azeroth, um, for finding out that glitch. Uh, if you want to know how to break out, uh, it's very simple, and you can actually go check out his video on his channel. Uh, it's just a simple method of using the Demon Hunter to double jump under this branch, double jump under this branch, double jump up here, and then facing the other way around, not the wall, doing a vengeful retreat up, and you'll be up on this ledge, and that's it. So there's two options here. We can either go explore the grounds back here, or we can go check out the city. So let's go check out the grounds first as um i know most people go check out the city anyways um and let's go see what's back here because i've never broken out of the well of eternity and i've been very excited to see azeroth before it was broken from the sundering so let's go fly back here into the grounds and let's go check out what's back here all right we made it onto the ground and as you can see uh we're already out of bounds from the map because normally you're supposed to only be inside where they want you to be what's really cool here is you can kind of see some really cool texture going on back here and i love the old uh night elf structures i mean that's just really cool but in lore they're actually called uh is this the highborn right correct maybe someone can correct me uh, I'm not very good with lore. I need to start learning more World of Warcraft lore because I know it would help me so much. But we're going to go take a walk this way and let's go see what we can find. Now, as we come out here from the courtyard, we can actually see the edge of the world already. And the edge of the map. So it does go down pretty far. And we're going to go take a nice stroll through the forest here let's go see what we find out here we got some beautiful trees going on and we do have a staircase leading up to the main entrance that we're actually start at so that's cool i wonder if you can actually walk on those stairs no, i'm curious i hear the beautiful zelda heart music going on <laughs> Probably shouldn't say Zelda, this is World of Warcraft, right? Alright, I'm curious if you can walk up these stairs. And you can, wow. I didn't think the stairs would be uh, accessible, but there's stairs in the back. Now, that's some dedication from Blizzard's part to get stairs in the back that you're never even supposed to walk on. Now, there's some cool structured buildings back here. Let's go take a look at one of these homes. And it does dismount you, so it does know you're inside of a building. Which is really interesting. And the music does change. Alright, let's get back out of our mount. So they are empty, obviously, as you can see. But the buildings do stand. I mean, it's pretty cool like that they put stuff back here that you're never supposed to see anyways. But that's one thing I do appreciate about Blizzard and their works. They, uh, they do put a lot of dedication outside of the uh, map, which is really nice. This is a really beautiful map to explore. I like all the colors, the trees, all the different leaves. Wow, so this does go pretty far back out. I feel like we're going to be running into Darnassus very soon. <laughs> That's what it feels like. Feels like the uh, Night Elf starting zone. As we come back here, there's even more and more trees. It just feels like there's trees after trees. These trees are pretty giant. I want to go down there, but I don't want to fall down yet, because I do want to go see the back of the city over here and see what we can find in the background. So all the buildings are empty. 
Ah, that's cool. You can see one of the dragons flying around. It's a red dragon. And uh, I think all the architecture you can walk on. Yep. Ah, this is going to be a really cool shot of the whole dungeon here. Especially with the demons and the dragons and everything fighting in the background here. We'll probably get a good shot of the well, too. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> That's really cool. See if I can zoom in here for you guys so you can get a better shot of the whole scene going on. This is just a really cool map and a cool dungeon to explore. We're definitely going to take a screenshot of this. That's a cool image right there. Alright, let's keep moving on. Ah, there's a ramp to get back up. Now this is cool. You know what? This is an awesome out of bounds right here. Because they actually help you. <laughs> Most of the time... You get out of bounds and it's like, nah, you glitched out of bounds. You're on your own, nerd. Wonder if we can go maneuver ourselves around the mountains. Like Uncle Rico would always say. You guys know I have to say that every video. At least once. Now, I'm going to be honest. We are going to go jump in the well, but that's going to be here in a minute. I want to go explore the out of bounds area. More around the city here first. The only thing is, I don't think we can... Oh no! Ooh, that was close. Can we make the jump is the real question. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna do it just for you, the people. Like, uh... Yeah, we made it. Look at that. Let's go. Ah, this is really cool. So there's a fountain over here. And you can see that fountain out of bounds, but you can actually never get to it. Can we jump in the fountain? No. There's actually a wall stopping us. Ah, that's a beautiful fountain. Some cool artwork out here. The music reminds me a lot of uh, Majula from Dark Souls 2. It's very peaceful. Alright, seems to be nothing out this way. But let's go back this way. And let's go take a little bit of a uh, look more under the uh, throne room over here. On the balcony. Under Queen Ajara. We have to make our way up here though. There we go. I want to go make it to the burned city in the back here. This is really cool. Because normally uh, in the dungeon, if I remember, you come out of a portal over here. And then you actually fight your way to the boss over here. And that's about it, but you can never actually get over here, so we're definitely going to go explore all this, that's for sure. But let's see if we can make our way up the mountains here. And you get a good shot of the burning city here. Let me zoom in a little bit.
And I like that you can walk through all these branches. <laughs> Makes it really nice to get around. Just trying to make sure I don't clip him back into bounds here. Alright. Now we've explored that side of the map. Let's go take a look down here. Let's go check out some of these burned homes. In this ancient night elf city. I wonder if it's going to recognize we're in a home here. No, we can still be on our mount. Cool. And a lot of these homes you can actually get in. Nothing inside of them. They look to be all empty. The aesthetic of this map is really cool. Sad, but cool. Alright, you guys know what we have to do. We definitely have to go down there and go check out some of these bigger homes. Oh, now this is a cool scene right here. Look at that. I like the hit, the broken statue. This is really neat. Now let's make our way down the path a little more. And then we gotta go. You know what? We have to test if these uh, flames are going to hurt us or not. Nope, they're just scenes. Scenery, so you can actually walk through them. They don't hurt. Nothing actually happens. But can we get upstairs here? We can. You gotta test if we can walk through this wall. No, you can't. Alright. Fair enough. Fair enough, Blizzard. Okay, that wall just, just clipped right through. We're gonna get a really good shot up close to these demons here. Someone needs to call a fire department. Get some buckets of water going here, because they're lighting this place up. Now that's a cool view. Let's zoom in here. like what Transformers would look like in World of Warcraft. Alright, let's go take a look back over here in some of the uh, neighborhood. I don't think this is the neighborhood I'd want to live in, though. As it's set on fire. You can see a lot of cool flame mechanics going on here. Fire doesn't look too bad for being a really old expansion. And how this dungeon was made a while back. Now this, this is interesting. This building's actually floating off the ground. You can still get inside of it. Can we go underneath it? Probably, but we definitely don't want to get stuck. Alright, let's go take a run back this way. Let's go see what's going on over the mountains over here. I definitely want to go see the skybox back here, because I want to go see what the edge of the world looks like. And then, we're going to go jump in the well. Because we have to end the video jumping in the well. Huh. <laughs> 
I love the one random alive tree back here that's just hanging out. <laughs> so random. All these dead trees are falling and burning, and you got this one living tree. You're such a warrior. Give props to that tree, guys. So we do got the edge of the world here. And as you can see, a lot of the trees actually clip out of bounds. They're just living underneath here. That's a cool view. Now, I have to go check out this one tree that's just hanging out back here. Man, that tree's a trooper. Pay my respects to this tree. It's like a beast. Hanging out, didn't get attacked from the flames. You're a warrior over here, my tree. It's like goat of trees right here. Way to go, tree. Way to go. You live your life. Show the burning legion what's up. <laughs> Alright, let's go jump in the well, guys. And let's go take a look and see what's actually inside of the well. Because we have to go find out. Go take another peaceful stroll through the burning forest. Man, I need to make some uh, ambience videos huh, on World of Warcraft. That would be cool. Alright, I'm going to be quiet for just a minute and let you all enjoy the atmosphere, and then once we get to the well, I will say hello. Alright, we're back. I'm going to see if I can get up a little higher so we can do this well jump. And see what we can do here. Oh, forgot to turn off Numlock for my auto walk here. The only thing is, I don't know if we can actually get back up to where we were. Unfortunately. Maybe. Might be a way back up here. Let's see if we can go around the, the way here. We'll go take another stroll through the burning neighborhood of nice neighborhoods. I mean, before this was, you know, burned to the ground, I mean, uh, the Night Elves, man, they, they lived it up. There's some nice homes. Be like some million dollar homes out here. I think we can make our way up the mounds here. Maybe not, I lied. All we want to do is jump in the well. Come on, there has to be a path back up, right? Yeah. 
There we go. All right, how's our fell charge rush doing? No. Oh my gosh. We were doing so good and then we fell. All right, let's do this again, but not be dumb this time. Where there's a will, there's a way, my friends. What I say? Ah, oh, there we go. Gosh, dang it. Okay, we made it finally up. Now... We just need to get over here so we can get up here so we can jump in the well. So we're going to wait for our next fell rush. And, uh, there we go. Nice. Now we're getting somewhere. After eternity. Ah, no pun intended. After eternity. Um, we finally are able to get back to where we want to be so we can dive into this well. We're going to cannonball essentially into the well um i think i gotta go around this way though well, let's go back up here there we go no don't fall there we go all right moment of truth we finally made it sorry everybody didn't mean to make that a lot longer than needed to be Now, moment of truth. Let's go jump inside of the well and see what's down here. What is inside of the well? Ah, oh, this is so cool. Wow. It's pretty big down here. You can cool better statue of the uh better view of the statue by the way too. Can we get to the bottom is the question. That is one of the coolest things ever. <laughs> we are under the well of eternity in World of Warcraft before the Sundering. And this is really cool. Well, everyone, I think I'm going to end the video right here. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this well of eternity video. I know it was a little bit longer. I do apologize for getting to this point. Uh, but thank you, everybody, for all the support you've been showing the channel. It's been growing rapidly every day with new subscribers. And I'm just... We're almost 2,000 subs, and that's just blows my mind out of the water like it's incredible and uh, i just want to say thank you to everybody for all that you're doing for all the love and support and comments you've been showing and uh anyways guys my name is nathan i'll see you on the next video take care